Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our Rookie Balboa run where we are trying to beat the game on Legendary Arm and Difficulty with four rookies per mission only. So four man run, rookie only. Um, on top of it, permanent dark events. We have accomplished uh, to almost have 13 dark events, I think. Uh, so everything across the board uh, is already on. And on top of it, uh, we are also just using secondary gear because the main story is we're very, very close to our to go to Waterworld and I don't want to risk losing that stuff. Today we're fighting against elite specters, lancers, andromedons, vipers, officers, a couple of elite purifier and a lot of loss. Uh, by thinking about it, I took only two times blue screen rounds because besides the elite uh, specters, and maybe the, uh, the Andromedon shell. There is not too much up in terms of uh, in terms of mechanical units. However, I loaded three mimic beacons, uh, a little bit of explosive stuff, and of course, since the losts are there, I want to make sure that we got our ultrasonic lure with us. So we're ready, and if you're ready, I'm ready, and we can kick this. Uh, bad boy off we got to kill every single one of them potentially including uh, a chosen that will show up and as a reward we might get between three and four uh, elarium cores which is what we're after good we just landed let's take a look here quite a nice high ground i shall i should say let's see if we can take uh, the rooftop there is the first pack already got it covered it is noticeable that we're slower than before we dropped the resistance order that allowed us uh, to move three extra tiles lightning strike was its name Unfortunately, we only have two resistance orders, and between the eyes was better. Good, we're moving up. And a bit over here. And a bit over here. Good. Overwatch. Overwatch. And let's kill that Lancer. They do have tactical analysis, which means even if they are running into cover, well, they really can't do that much. Down to two hit points. Okay, fair enough. Good. He's potentially going to run back. He being the... Uh, Advent uh, Captain and we got a real enemy the soul stealer is really bad and also summoning uh, with general is bad so we got to be careful here that's one of the elders chosen and it's not gonna make things easy on us Let's try to take care of it as quickly as possible. All right, that was a bit of a waste of turn. But feel free. I don't mind. Good. 
Good, the losses are finally starting to show up. Good, let's see if this triggers. Only loss and a turret. Well, the turret sucks, that's the problem. There's an Andromedon down here, careful. Sure, if just taken a normal shot, we do have a superior stock, so that would have been a hundred percent kill. Stupid me. Enemy destroyed. You're a cold blooded killer, Commander. It takes one to know one. Heading out. All right, fifty fifty. We have blue screen rounds, we don't, which means we're not going to go in. We can do that next turn, no reason to rush. Let's just get rid of the loss uh, so that they're not triggering any further advent. Never mind. Good. We're likely going to see a tracking shot. There's nowhere to go. And of course, enemies are running into us. It would be absolutely fantastic if um, if we wouldn't be standing up here being attacked by the loss, but instead they are actually going for uh, the enemies. Moving up. More loss. Well, funny, right? Trying to get rid of uh, the loss. I'm still trying to get that uh, in line of sight of the tower. Unfortunately, 94 shot missed. Okay. But there is a pack further down. Good to know. Good we wouldn't want to trigger them. Ready to no I want this cover here. We're reloading. And look, Slicinator is taking overwatch as well so the moment that the lot's down there is moving up we're going to have two overwatch shots a new lost swarm appears fair enough We haven't triggered those guys yet. We 
very good. We're still safe here. The tracking shots, however, are a bit annoying. There we go, that should trigger uh, her overwatch. Okay, apparently not. Okay, so let's get rid of some of these guys at least. One, two, three. We got auto loaders. Okay, we're slowly but surely moving closer. to stand there I'm okay standing in the open as long as it is just for the tower getting one more loss down and let's kill the tower it's one hit Tower gone. We're moving in, so next turn we can take the very solid positions here. Knowing farewell that there is a pack below us. And now we have triggered yet another pack. It would be a perfect time to use the lure. Unfortunately, they did not destroy the cover. The Vipers will be busy because they will continue to bind the enemy. Why are we getting hit, by the way? We were not even in reach. So let's get rid of oh this is so depressing we're trying that again good sam at least realized that he needs to hit something in order to be useful. Ready for the fireworks. Good. Time to get rid of... Uh, time to get rid of uh, the Andromedon. I think we need to play it with a Mimic Beacon anyways. But before we're going to do that, 
I would like to at least have a try to kill this guy. Air trigger, execute anything. Okay. Better trigger another pack, the ones below us. Viper is binding instead of dealing damage, that's good. And we're having another tracking shot. Nice. The Vipers are taking a fair amount of damage. Kill moves up. Let's get that Andromedon down. I suppose that's why the elders want you back on the tactical side, Commander. Yeah, I'd, I I would still go for that Andromedon. I think we're fine. The Vipers will not use Poison Spit, they prefer to bind. More lots are coming. That's good. As long as we're removing the dashers, we're fine. So the Vipers are taking pretty severe damage now. The most dangerous game, hardly. Down. Good, let's get rid of a few of the dashers. I want to keep some ammunition. The chimney just exploded. Well, wonderful. I hate to play completely on the edge, but... I think it's the right uh, call this time. Alright, Sam goes all out and let's kill that Viper. Sur la 
So let's go for the dashers first. Look, we have a target rich environment here, might as well just farm them off. Decent position here, the high ground is helpful so that we can at least hit. It's always super dangerous to do it without cover and I wouldn't recommend it. <clears throat> but these are desperate times and we require desperate measures. So no longer 100% hit against the rest, so might as well finish the Viper. And get back into position so that we can start hitting next turn. What should we try this time? Good. That's still far enough away to just barely use the tracking shot. Good, Synapse here. The only one who does not have um, a scope, and it really shows. Because he's the only one from high ground that does not have the 100% chance to kill the Lost. with uh, Synapse, Slicinator moves a tiny bit back, reloads, reload XQR6 and Overwatch. Okay, he should not have a target uh, against us anymore. At least I wouldn't know where his tracking shot would be coming from. Very good. Good, moving in. I want the other side next. I'm on it. Je reste en observation. And we're overwatching. There is a small overwatch trap. Not, not a real overwatch trap. We knew they were there. Oh, well, maybe it's a bigger overwatch trap, or maybe not. And there we go, new tracking shot, fantastic. Fan-fucking-tastic. There was something over there. Not sure if it was another pack. The elders really don't like it when you kill off their priests. We know this is where the purifier is at. Let's spread out. I don't want to be hit. Purifier takes some damage. Nice, nice.
Yep, there's another pack. I just saw it. Sunlan sent something else. Well, that's a problem. If things start to burn, typically things also start to fall apart. Stun Lancer and Spectre. We're reloading. Purifier is killed. I almost feel bad for them. They've got no idea what they're in for. Hostiles pacified. Burn up your ammo fast. Good XQ6 goes over here. And we're continuing to overwatch. Okay, cool. It's time to make the elders proud. There's one more pack. And so far we're doing reasonably well. I would like to kill that pack before we're engaging with him. Reload, overwatch. Reload, overwatch. Reload, overwatch. Reload Overwatch. Good. Unfortunately, we lost the loot, but it is what it is, right? Good, we're back. I need a short break. This mission is intense. Ooh. This one pack here starts to annoy me like big times. In a perfect world, they would take the bait and we're just... We're just uh, going to Overwatch trap them. They are just standing there, which is a problem. A real one. Enjoy these final breaths. Come on, it can't be that difficult to just rush into us. Is you going to trigger? No. Moving out. I'm on it. I'm on it. If they move left or right, we would effectively get a good shot. If we're beginning to if we're beginning to uh, trigger them. Never mind, I think he just triggered himself. No, just ever so slightly checking if we're still here. Okay. You really think you can hide from me? Get there now. Come get some. I'm still waiting for them to 
make a false move. Apparently the Chosen is doing the exact same. But next turn I can get behind the tree and push them into this direction, which should uh, pu push them directly into the arm of our guys in high ground. Why is this pack not triggering? The Chosen, on the other hand, seems to just move along the uh, the outer perimeter of where he could, uh, where he could move. Good. Next round, we're going to trigger. I wanted Lyrical uh, up here and not on the back. There we go. Um, okay, they didn't know where the rest of us uh, were, but yet they still decided to basically move into a perfect position. That is a bit suspicious. Still execute right there. The Rickel moves up. Gotta be careful not to position ourselves too far out here. Alright, Overwatch. And he's attacking plus bleeding rent, so maybe moves over here to trigger another Overwatch. Moving into a nice little location here. Come on. Oh, are you kidding me? Before we go to the extreme, I still try to kill him. Okay, I would like this shot to hit, please. 
<laughs> this is so... Sometimes it is ridiculous. 80% missed. 70% missed. 70% missed. Just so that he can get like his one hit in. Thank you. Good, I could use another Mimic Beacon, but I don't want to, out of sheer principle. So that's four Overwatches right there. I lose all hope if, if these all will miss. Of course, Undying Loyalty triggered. Hey, why don't you pick on someone your own size? Keeping my eye on you. There's an art to what I do. Moving to designated position. Good. The reason why I wanted to keep our Mimic Beacon is because... The Chosen has General, and that means they can summon quite a few um, troopers, which will be a problem for us. Good. Chosen shows up. Chosen chooses a pistol overwatch. Well, look, I'm okay with that. First, let's shred him. And remove the cover. Nice. Secondly, let's hit him with everything we've got. Ninety percent. Come on. That's a critical hit, actually. Hundred percent. That's fantastic. And ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, that was uh, easier than expected. I was already making a plan as of how we're using the mimic beacon to. Uh, to fight against the four summonings that he has at this point in time. He basically can summon an entire platoon that is as strong as, as our rookies. Better even. Good. Such a good mission. Let's see. Two cores is what we wanted. And we got quite a bit of resources. So in terms of building, I think we're going with one war suit. Plasma grenade 
is not fully needed we could get another experimental powered weapon question is do we really need that let's just keep that one core for now although we really don't need anything else so might as well go for that and we got another blaster launcher cool very cool so we could theoretically go into the last mission with two shredstorm cannons or two blaster launchers a bit more intel would make sense you have sacrificed one of the elders greatest creations and for that there can be no punishment less than eternity in the void I was very good so avatar Finally got our health plus one. Very well done. I think there is nothing else for us to do. Can't do, can't do, can't do. Infiltrate isn't bad, but we wouldn't need that. Out of curiosity, training center. Over the course of that entire campaign, we... <laughs> Look at the amount of XCOM AP. We have like 270 AP. Very good. Good. Avatar autopsy in zero days. We have a mission available that it won't be easy. Which, if we're taking a look here, our rookies are ready. Roby is the best rookie with six hit points base. That is so good in comparison to the others uh, who have like four hit points at base. And I think we have now officially unlocked uh, the network tower mission. And with that, guys, we have the target site locked in, Commander. This is our chance to strike at Advent's heart. Once we control the network tower, we can finally show the world what the aliens are doing. There's no turning back after this. Yeah, I think. Look, we're we're going to do that. Uh, I'm not going to do another covert ops mission. In the grand scheme of things, this is not relevant. So what we're going to do is the next mission will actually be the network tower and then it's potentially a three-parter depending on how far I get in the last mission uh, potentially a three-parter where we're going through that last uh, entire last mission. I need a bit of time to prepare and also mentally think about what kind of um, what kind of equipment I would like to take for the last mission. This is completely crazy. I would have never thought that we actually make it to the network tower. So this is for me, that's a big achievement. And um, if you feel the same way, uh, then uh, leave a comment down below and just share your thoughts. Uh, I really, really appreciate uh, that this challenge uh, was yet again one of the challenges that was completely impossible but it ended up being at least possible to the network tower whether or not we make it through the last mission is a completely different story but now is the time to root uh, for it leave your comment down below and uh, besides the appreciation of what we've done i would like to get your uh, your predictions do you think that i can kill one two or even make it to the last room of the last uh, mission or do you think that it's actually possible to take it all I don't know. Let me know um, and see you in two days. Bye bye.